that's in his head going forward since that's his first throw of the game. But one of the things I remember about him coming out of school is he's able to wipe things away pretty easily and move on. The Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. And last time they were very fortunate, this offense. They went for it on four, turned it over in their own territory. But the other guys held up. They didn't give up any points. So how about the guy with the number one headset on the sidelines, the head coach? That was planned going into it. Not necessarily to not get the first down or to, to have the defense have to hold but he up. he trusted his defense. Trusted his defense very much. And I think that that's how he's going to play this game. Go for it. Be aggressive because I've got the wild bunch backing me up over here on my own side. Now we'll see what his offense can do. And oh, so close as he takes it all the way to the two-yard line. A big play there on the option. 77 yards. They'll come out in the pistol. After the big play, a chance to finish now on first and goal. Quick throw taken in by Sneed. No gain there on the completion. It'll be second down. One man in the backfield. That's Ingram on second and goal. And he'll get in. Touchdown, Baltimore. A two-yard touchdown grab as his guys are able to strike first here in this opening quarter. Brandon, they just got the ball, and already they're in the end zone, and you're getting ready to talk about the PAT. That was fast. Tucker able to connect on the extra point, and it's now a 7-0 game. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. This is taken about seven yards deep. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Atlanta offense out there for their next drive. And the interception thrown in the red zone last time. We'll see if they can rebound. I just have to think the last thing he said as they went back out there was, don't do that again. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I think, that, I think that not only did he say that, but he also told him, let's put it in the end zone that it's supposed to be in, all right? The end zone we're trying to score. I know we're being a little bit facetious here, but the bottom line is take care of the football and everything else should flow from there. Quick lesson, never ask the play-by-play -play <laughs> guy a question. Hey, you're my partner. I know you're right there with me. A big hitter to start the drive has him up near midfield here for first and ten. Freeman. He'll get three up to midfield. When we see those runs to the perimeter, when we see those runs to the edge, we think about big breakers, don't we? In this case, it was a modest game, but it does open up possibilities here on second down. From midfield now, here's Ryan. Caught by Jones. Only three yards on the catch. It's third down. On third down, Devontae Freeman. And he'll lose yardage here. Back at the 47. A loss of a yard, and it brings up fourth. Wonder if they just kind of outguess themselves a little bit, trying to run it on third down. Probably should have gone to the air to try and pick it up. Instead, the punting unit will have to run on the field. And no move to get the offense off the field. They're going on fourth and five. Hey, Charlie. 
Gun, gun, gun. Motion. Reset, reset, reset. Watch 30. They're going on fourth down. It's Ryan. It's caught. Jones. It's a gain of 13 and a first down for Atlanta. A little football 101 there. You just see the receiver try to run down the defender, meaning he goes right at him and really trying to move him a little bit towards the center of the field so he can put his foot in the ground and break to the out to the sideline and make a catch. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. That's good for 21 yards and a first down. This has been a good drive so far. It's been the running game for the most part that's powered them down there. Another nice burst there, picking up a first down. Now it's first and 10, as you say, in the red zone. 57 is the mic. Get that quarterback at all costs. 51, Doug. Crash, crash. Freeman again, a first down carry. And he'll get this one down to about the 10 yard line. A gain of three, second down. He's had success on this drive, but not on this play. Finally, they bowed up defensively. I think they were determined not to let him take it pretty much all the way down the field. Yeah, it looks like they handled their run.